Hey everyone, welcome to what once was the vintage market and the very last day of the blessing board being in this location in Oakmont. And I'm doing a final walkthrough today. Um, thought I'd show you what was underneath everything that we had here before. And it's pretty, pretty incredible. Uh, it touches my heart to know where we were, where we ended up here, but also where we're headed. And um, it's a beautiful story, it really is. So I just, walk with me, let's do a final walk through the vintage market. Um, so many memories. Um, come on with me, thanks. Sure you remember the double doors. was the chalkboard wall that we used to put huge messages on for all of our families that came to the blessing board. Over here, if you remember, ever look down the hallway, this was the cross that stood here that represented everything we are at the blessing board. It's gone to the new place. Take a look at this hallway. It's amazing. So here's where the curtains would have hung. Here's where the lights would have come on. This was our Asian area. Couches and beautiful paintings and beautiful artwork along these walls. Over here, where this truck is, this is what we call the annex had tables and we had those wrapping with chairs on it and um, this is what we have now. We had to clear everything out. Um, so come on, finish down the hall. Um, I remember when we first started expanding the vintage market and this is all that's left of this sign that my husband and I made for the vintage market. and. Um, Anyway, so this was the hallway, and um, pretty amazing, huh? So come on in where it all started. So this is what we call room one, the main room of the vintage market. Here we had fireplaces over time. We used to have entertainment here years ago. Um, loved it. And um, just look at it. It's amazing. It's amazing. The door we always had to keep closed. Just our counter is gone. Broken up for scrap. Oh, unbelievable. So beautiful windows. <laughs> that um, we had dressed in the wonderful uh, messages that one of our volunteers had placed on them to tell the story of the blessing board. At least those are still here. And um, I wanna share with you one last story. And I mean, this tells it all. Um, Ruth, a wonderful patron of the blessing board in the vintage market comes in every week to visit with us. And um, she actually came and helped pack on the second day of when the vintage market was packing. It took us two days only to pack all of this, it's amazing. Anyway, she came in and she walked through, and now this is a person who said, wow, this place is beautiful, this place is amazing. And she walked in here and she goes, what a transformation. And I'm going, what do you mean? And she said, it so ugly and honestly it was like this big revelation to me and I went you know what it really is it is kind of ugly underneath it all and that told me exactly what we're about it's the presence of the Lord that's in this place he's the one who made this place absolutely beautiful and you know everyone that came in the door felt that presence 
It was on the faces of everyone who volunteers here in our hearts. It's our mission. And that just goes to show me that his presence was here and it goes before us and it's going to fill the new place in Shaler. And I've been there and it's amazing. I know we were disappointed when we had to move from this building. We thought this place was perfect. But you know, wait till you see the new place. It's perfect. And God knew that well before we did. So anyway, this is our last day here. Stick with us. Um, we will have updates regularly. We'll let you know when the new vintage market will open, and it will. And um, until then, our hearts are with you, and we ask for your prayer and support as we go through this transition. And uh, we love you. Thanks.